In this video, we're gonna go over how to make over $1,000 a day with affiliate marketing. How do I know that? Because the person that mentored me that had helped hundreds of students achieve the same results are about to teach you the three steps and how to do it within the next 30 to 60 days. So that being said, intro. Look at that, as if by magic, we got multimillionaire Gary Kramer. We had him teleport here next to me so that you guys could learn the three steps on how to make your first $1,000 a day with affiliate marketing. But if you guys don't know who Gary is, make sure you check the interview below on how to make over a million dollars with affiliate marketing. I mean, this one isn't as ambitious, right? If you only wanna make $1,000. If you wanna make a million, go check the link in the description. But, you know, I'm actually really super excited because of the fact that not only do you have a lot of success, and not only did you help me get a lot of success, but you have helped normal average people achieve like crazy, like their first $1,000 a day. Like, can you imagine what it'd be like if all this did, this interview helped you make $1,000? Be insane, man. So can you like tell me like one of the crazy success stories to help break their limiting beliefs on someone that has achieved the $1,000 a day? Sure, yeah, I'm happy to. Um, you know, the thing is, is that I try to look at people who are just, who have like big uh, limiting beliefs or maybe they have big technical issues mm -hmm. to try to overcome. So I, I like to tell the story about Bonnie because she's, she was a 62 year old grandma who after 90 days inside of my program was able to pay off her, her, she had two grown children and she was able to pay off their student loans. And so that story like really resonated with me because she had a lot of te technical, yeah. she was like a technophobic, right? Mm -hmm. She was afraid to get on the computer and she just really wasn't good at it. Even now, like this is a couple years ago, even now she still struggles <laughs> with tech stuff, but yet she, she's had all this success. So the story goes something like this. Now, Bonnie had never made any money online before. She had lost her corporate job. You know, again, she's like in her 60s. She lost her corporate job I believe it was with IBM or something like that mm. um, some fortune 500 company and she her whole family was in a financial state like they were just pretty desperate so she turned to the internet to try to find a solution to their their financial problems she spent a lot of time trying different things and never had any success at all never made any money online she came across me and my program and she said that it instantly resonated with her and she believed in it from that very first moment until now. Okay, so what happened with her was I have my sim my system is pretty simple. Like and I, it's intentionally mm. simple. I've broken down what ordinarily you would think would be a very very complex system. There's literally like a thousand moving parts when it comes to what I do, but what I've become very good at over the years yeah. is simplifying and taking a very complex machine and turning it into something that just literally anybody, I'm thinking the lowest common denominator. I'm thinking about every single person needs to be able to do this. And if, if everybody can't do it, then I'm not really sold on it. I believe that something needs to be so easy, so simple, so doable that anybody can do it. Otherwise, you know, how am I going to help everybody, right? So Bonnie's a good example because she she wasn't very good with technical stuff at all. She's very easily, I don't know, like anytime anything tech comes up, she kind of she's like, I don't know how to do that. It'll be simple stuff, but this was not like a brick wall for her. So the three simple steps to my system is number one, you have to create an ad on a social media website like uh, Facebook. Number two, you have to create a, a pre-sale page that they click They click on the ad and they go to this pre-sale page. And the point here is that the pre-sale page, it, it basically um, takes that person who's on social media, just like talking to their, their friends and family, and it changes their mindset. It just subtly shifts their mindset over to becoming like a buyer of something, a buyer of a product. You can't just click somebody into and suddenly expect them to buy something because they're not there to buy. They're not on Facebook to buy something, right? So they have to have an ad that people are gonna click on and then you have to have a, just this intermediate web page, right? That transitions their mindset from a, from a social media mindset to a buyer mindset, right? And then you click them from there to some sort of offer. And uh, usually it's a very broad appeal offer, like something like weight loss, 
or um, you know, health, wealth, or relationship offers, basically what it is. So I taught this system to Bonnie. Um, that's it in a nutshell, by the way. That is basically the no, three, those sets three system. things. Yes, right. We thought we were gonna be here for like an hour. <laughs> <laughs> but let me tell you so a little bit about Bonnie and how she came about um, having her success. Which, by the way, what was she made one hundred and sixty thousand dollars in her first ninety days. Oh man, she had a thirteen thousand dollar day. You know, I mean, she's just she's killing it. She was able to pay off her her children's student loans. Now she's a world traveler, and she's one of the top super affiliates in the world, from from, <laughs> from newbie million, grandma yeah. to to top super affiliate in the world. In fact, yeah. in fact if you know the ClickBank network, it's, <laughs> it's over a hundred thousand affiliates with thousands of products, uh, thousands of vendors, and she became the number one super affiliate in the entire ClickBank network. This is a multi-billion dollar affiliate network, and she became the number one super affiliate Didn't in 90 Clickbank, days. did ClickBank like, call you? <laughs> well, no, I talk to ClickBank every day. I'm kind of like yeah. close with them, and they're like, do you know bon uh, someone named Bonnie? <laughs> I was like, yeah, she's my student. Why? And they're like, well, she's like the number one super affiliate. Like, who is this lady? She's like, you know, I'm like, well, anyway. Uh, <laughs> that happened a lot, by the way. Uh -huh. I, I had that happen many times since then. Now they're getting accustomed to it, you know. But, okay, so now back to Bonnie's story, okay? I basically, bon Bonnie was doing everything wrong in the beginning, and I just had to guide her through exactly what to do. Now, we like to say that, that you can use ugly images to make a fortune online. <laughs> ugly images, <clears throat> it might sound kind of, kind of confusing, but I taught her exactly the type of image that she can use in her Facebook ad to generate a hundred times more clicks than most internet marketers can do. I'm talking about people who really know their stuff. And this very simple psychological technique that I use results in up to a hundred times higher click-through ratio, which means about 100th the cost. So mm -hmm. you can get 100 times bigger results than the average guy. This is what the power that I put in her hands, okay? So she was able to achieve those results pretty much overnight because she was able to copy and emulate my success. I showed her exactly these million dollar ads that I had been using over the last couple of years and she just copied it emulated it, made subtle little changes to it, and she had the same just crazy high impact ad that I had. Just this, it was like a it was like the the cousin to my ad. It was almost like the twin sister to my ad, okay? Mm -hmm. Now the pre-sell page. She's like, I don't know anything about pre-sell page. I don't un understand a HTML what? I don't know what the, even that stands for. She's completely confused by it. I said, don't worry about it. I'm just gonna give you one of my million dollar pre-sell pages and you just take it and you follow my instructions, upload it into your little space online, your little little hosting thing, and just change the photo, change the image with your ad image, and change the headline to match your offer, right? And these little changes. And I explained to, the, to her all the psychology that goes into this and what makes my pre-sale pages convert higher than anybody else's pre-sale pages out there. And I explained it in a way that's really simple to understand. She was, again, able to emulate. So what Bonnie doesn't know tech stuff, she doesn't know really much about making money online, but what she's good at is following instructions and emulating what I show her, exactly what to do. It's really difficult not to do if you just take the steps, right? So she was able to create a pre-sale page that had the same exact kind of click-through ratio that my stuff had. Now the next step in the system is to pick a winning offer, so a million dollar um, uh, affiliate offer. And I showed her exact, in fact I just told her, I said, <laughs> just yeah. go after this one because this is the best offer out there right now which is what I do to my students I pretty much tell them what to promote and I also teach them how to fish so if you want to go out and find the best offers this is what to look for and I tell them exactly the stuff and it's not the kind of stuff that most people would think <clears throat> I really have have it dialed in I know exactly what to look for and I guarantee you it's not what you think so I know I mean there is simplicity behind it but there's also some things that most people don't realize uh, which I can't get into now. But basically, she was able to copy my system in a very short time. And within a couple of weeks, she was up and running ads. Um, and then she just continued with my, you know, I basically teach my, teach my students to take massive action and to stay laser focused on your, on your goals and then just don't give up. And she was able to do those three things and emulate my system. And next thing you know, mm -hmm. she, she was literally printing money or 
not literally, <laughs> but yeah. that would be illegal. Yeah. <laughs> but but she, said, she said she would come down and tell her husband, like, I just printed another $5,000 yeah. today. I printed another $6,000 today. And, and that's the way that she felt after she had that breakthrough. And I call mm-hmm. it like a, just a, a, a breakthrough, a financial breakthrough. I, I think one of the best quotes that I heard someone say about like just the way you teach is like affiliate marketing. Like for, for most times, it's a long process, especially if you're like blogging and whatnot. But the way that you do it with direct ads, like I hear it compared to the best way to make a bunch of money in a single hour without a gun. <laughs> like, meaning without having to actually, like, rob a bank, right? Like that, yeah. Yeah, but um, actually, before she actually reached her success, I mean, $13,000 in a single day, that's freaking Crazy, insane for a 62-year-old yeah. woman. And keep in mind, she's doing, like, 400, 500% ROI. Yeah. So she only spent, like, $1,000, 2000 $2, dollars that day what, to achieve that. Can you tell me a time when she almost gave up? Because normally they say the best, like, the, the best moment of your life is actually the worst. Because if it wasn't for that worst moment or that kind of, like, that little pivot point where... You made a different decision she wouldn't have experienced that success right what was yep. like that biggest limiting belief that prevented her from actually achieving massive success okay now no normally <clears throat> i would give you the answer that you probably expect to hear mm-hmm. but i've actually asked her this very yeah. same question and the truth is is that she said that she never had doubt she never had she doubt. never had doubt but you got to think you know she's also 62 years old she's seen it all and she recognized, it all. <laughs> she recognized the, the truth behind this system. Mm-hmm. And, and most people, what you're talking about, most people do have limiting beliefs. Most, most people don't believe in themselves. Most people don't believe in the system. They have something that they look at as an excuse to back out. That's the difference. That's the thing that separated her. And I think a lot of that, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll take credit for it, yeah. <laughs> is the, mind, the yeah. mindset coaching that I offer my students. I really, I really try to put them into a state of mind where they're not going to back out where they don't have any doubts in themselves and where they don't have any doubts in the system. Now, if you if you are being coached by the, I hate to say this out loud, but it sounds weird, but like by the number one super affiliate in, in the, the world, in the, world on the, the best super affiliate <laughs> in the <laughs> world. But you know, no, the Bonnie's click, the, the best now. Yeah, no, no, yeah, for a little while she was. We have to have Bonnie come here and just be like, I'm going to teach you little <laughs> young folks how to make money. She would hate you if you, if you talked about her like that. Oh, no, no. She's got this young heart. You know, I don't even, she, yeah. Yeah, but you know, yeah, I don't know, man. So, so yeah, she, you know, I, I think I gave her the tools uh, and maybe her life lessons all also kind of like like prepared her for this moment yeah. you know that that she she had the mindset she came into it believing in it completely and she just didn't stop now a lot of people would just stop after they say okay well Gary told me that if I take these steps I can achieve success she took the steps and she didn't achieve success you know how many times how many different ads she had to run how many 19 19 which by the way is about the average number of times you have to fail at something before you succeed at something mm. if you can't handle that then you're not ever gonna achieve success unfortunately for anybody out there listening you have to take massive action that's why massive action is the key cornerstone to success massive action staying focused and never giving up so all you have to do is master yourself, really. I'll give you the, I'll give you the, the ad, I'll give you the pre-sale page, I'll give you the offer, I'll give you the system, the simple three-step system. But you have to master yeah. yourself. And that's where I come in because I think a lot of coaches and mentors, they don't really take responsibility for teaching people the important stuff. You know, like if you go to school, if you go to high school, for example, or college, do you recall ever going to a class where they taught you take massive action, stay focused, and never give up? No, they, they tell don't. you to sit down, shut up, be quiet, and hand in your homework. On yeah, time. you know, it, it, but but you 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 really have to master yourself, and I think mm-hmm. that that should be a central part of our of our um, self development and a central part of our of our education mm-hmm. system. You know, I don't really believe in the modern you know and the old you know system of, of colleges and stuff like that anymore. Higher education, mm-hmm. I believe that we're in, a, we're in a new era, you know, where the entrepreneurs and people are going to be work, you know, in the next few generations, people are going to wonder, like, what the hell, university, what were they thinking? And we have to pioneer that gap. We, we literally have to, we have our parents, like, holding on to what they were taught, and then we can see the new frontier, and we have to have the courage to bridge that gap and step outside of that norm and become the next generation where we're not afraid, where we don't have to, we don't, you know, you feel the pressure from your parents saying you have to go to university, you have to go to college, that's what you have to do. 
But in reality, we know, we can feel the itch. We know that that's not the case. We know it, but it's hard to resist your parents mm -hmm. and it's hard to resist society and everybody who you, you know, you look up to telling you that you have to do it this way when we know that we don't. Mm -hmm. So, you know, my, my system, I'm trying to help give people that, you know, that, that confidence to step outside, step outside of their comfort zone and step into this, step into something else, something different that's going to give them you know, just freedom, you know, from, from I, yeah. that life. That I totally, way. I totally understand that because what you said right there is like so crucial that everyone, because when people get an entrepreneurship, they're like, oh yeah, I just run one little ad and like, if I don't make money within 24 hours, it doesn't work. Right. Like it works if you work, but only if you <laughs> work, the faster and harder you work, the faster it will work, right? Any single person who's ever failed mm -hmm. really at anything, I can take it back to these three things. Did you take massive action? And they'd be like, yeah, I did what you said. No, did you take massive action? Yeah, there's like a difference. failing 19 times yes. and still going. Yes, Yeah. Like funny. Did you, did you stay focused? I heard, hear people say like, well, you know, I'm trying to like do multiple things at the same time, or I just got an offer in the email, email you know, for this offer and this offer, or I'm trying to multitask. Uh-uh. Mm. One goal at a time, focus on that goal, and when you achieve that goal, scrap it and move on, set another goal, and stay focused on that goal. It's a step process, but you have to have focus or you can't succeed. And then the third thing is just don't give up. I'm telling you, every single person who succeeded has followed those three mm. tips throughout history. And everybody who's failed at anything has failed at least one of those three things to cause the failure. Usually it's giving up too soon or just not being focused or just not taking enough action. What, what you're like talking about right now kind of like reminds me of uh, Jim Rohn and his law of averages and how when you just like hustle so long and so hard that the law of averages swing in your favor and just by probability, yeah. you run out of ways that Fail. don't work yeah. and then you you accidentally find one that works Oops, and funny it took her 19 <clears throat> times and then bam 13,000 yeah. but it's really really key though it's really important to start off with that with that blueprint mm -hmm. to success because let me tell you there's a million paths that you can take that are going to last that are going to yeah. take you 20 years to get there even yeah if why, you, even why, if you take massive why action. fail more than you have to is like right. what i always say if she didn't have a mentor or whatever like if i didn't even have you I would have probably took 10, 20 years to learn everything that you know. Exactly. And Bonnie could have, could have kept running ads on her own forever. Mm -hmm. And maybe 12 years later, she might have stumbled upon a winning ad accidentally. But the, the thing that makes her story so profound, and this is why all the people, I'm talking about the CEO and all the higher ups at ClickBank are raving about Bonnie is because she did it overnight. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, she became an overnight super affiliate. She robbed a bank without a gun. Without That's a what gun. she able to do. Guys, That's right. so that hopefully this helps the three steps to make your first $1,000 today. Number one, you need to make sure that you find an ugly ad that turns into a lot of money. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you know, we're having a free training this week or if you're late, I don't know why you're late, man. Seriously, dude, you could just watch the replay, but it's only going to be up for like a little bit. Number two, you have to find out how to pre-sell your audience from a social mentality to a buying mentality. Number three, you need to find an evergreen offer like in health, wealth, love, and happiness that you could just have that insane scalability. Not like some little elephant niche that you only have 100,000 people to market to. Something big that you could literally live off for like years to come like Bonnie. But the biggest thing that I want to ask you are three things. Number one, you're gonna take out all massive action. Number two, are you gonna never give up? And number three, what is number three? Laser focus, man. Laser, Laser. focus. And, and all I gotta say is what he was saying. Bonnie is 62 years old. She knew that she doesn't have the time in the world to waste to figure this out. And same thing with you. Time is more valuable than money. And what are you gonna do in the next hour that's gonna push you further to get the results? Like the smart entrepreneur that I know you are, you'll probably try the free training that Bonnie learned from in the webinar below or watch the replay. And um, yeah, man, make sure you subscribe to both of our channels because we're doing a reality TV show. We're flying five to 10 out of you guys here to Bali to live with us. With that being said, because you always like doing it. I, I'm ready. I'm ready this time. Let's go.